Hello everyone, I am Pyro Falcon, this is Monster Rancher, and that asshole is Ryusi, who is about to get our vengeance all over his face because of him beating us the last time into injury and robbing us of our A-class tournament. I'm gonna... I am going to have cooked rabbit for dinner. That's right, Ryusi. Rosewater's gonna turn you into poop. L literally, he's going to turn you into poop, because he's going to eat you and then poop you. Here we go. Thank you, the Akamura. All right. <laughs> okay, stay in his face. We've got way more speed than we did the last time. He's only got a 13% chance to hit that one, too. Last time it was in the 20-ish range, I think. And I need to land my... You piece of dog shit you future you piece of future dog shit nice okay now the problem is i need to make sure that the next attack that lands is going to be a knockout blow because i don't want him going into fury mode and immediately i fucked that up there we go very appropriate that the kill sh or the knockout shot was a bite Ah, oh, I hope you ripped his leg off, Rosewater. Good job. You're the best doggy. Who's our last opponent? Oh, Guardian. Whatever. I I, st I have to respect Guardian. You you cannot disrespect your opponent. You must respect your opponent. But I think we'll be okay unless we get extremely unlucky with RNG because I don't think he hits particularly accurately. And if we stay in his face, he'll be down to his power attacks anyway. Ooh, except his power attacks are where his strength lies. That's a problem. All right, let's try to stay in range three, because that is an intelligence attack. Oh, 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 oh. Good deal. Try to stay in range three. Yup, yup, yup. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, okay, he does have higher accuracy from in close. Ooh. Get, get away, get away, get away. Ooh, he's got really high defense. I didn't think it'd be that high. Oof. This is gonna come down to RNG, then. Alright, just keep your distance. He's he's less accurate the further we are away from him. Push him away. There you go. I don't even think I should be attacking right now. Well, I need to attack when I'm, I get 99 guts, but... God, I, I did not see his defense. I didn't realize it was that high. That's higher than, uh, than the golems we were dealing with. All right, good job, Rosewater. Whoo boy, that puts Rosewater in the S-Class. Generation 1 monster, not even five years old, but still not even getting any retirement alerts. Oh, man. Tigers and pixies. Tigers, pixies, and nagas, but mainly the first two. <laughs> This is why I'm excited to go back to Monster Rancher 4 and try that all pixie run. Oh, brother. Well done, Rosewater. Paw bump. Still have made a tremendous loss, or we've taken a tremendous loss monetarily um, for from our boy here, unfortunately. But it is what it is. We had a pretty decent buffer. Um, if I have to, our next monster can be a money maker, or we can at least start a very good monster and then freeze them if we have to, so I'm not overly concerned about things. All right, I'm gonna pause the episode for one second while I get some information on the timing of the invitations. Okay, the good news is all of the invitations happen on the first week of their particular month, which means as long as I keep what I'm doing going and I only do trainings on the first week of every month, then I should get the, uh, I, I should be able to see the invitations anyway. So I think we're fine. Um, we'll just keep getting speed up. I want speed at 999. I didn't realize we'd get it up this high and we've got the time. Um, so we may as well shoot for a perfect number on that one.
What happens if I do a training when a number is already at 999? Does is does the additional number just not count? I mean, I kind of assume that's the way it is. All right, so the next invitation should happen on March 1. So we'll just do speed until March 1, and we'll see if we get the invitation and go from there. Who's a good doggo? Um, we'll try it regardless of where our speed is at. I want to give it a try because we won't have any other way to test our abilities in the S class. We have to do the big four because I'm not doing an official tournament. I don't need to do an official tournament. I may as well spend that time training. We just have to make sure that we uh, attend the tournaments as they come. Yeah, he'll get speed 999 pretty easily. And then we'll have to work on accuracy. And then life, maybe? I guess. Okay. No, not the Mystic Snake. I know you're tired, Rosewater. You have done phenomenally. Like, I cannot... I cannot overstate how good of a doggo... How good of a boy you have been. Phone firing off my alarm while I'm talking, waxing poetic to my good boy, goodest boyest to doggo. You jerk. All right. So if it does well, once we're back from the training, we'll get the invitation. Fingers crossed. And hopefully Rosewater will be at 950 at that point. Oh yeah, he'll be at 950. Holy crap. The untouchable doggo. The untouchable Rosewater. That'll probably be the title of the finale if Rosewater takes us the whole way. He's a Generation 1! Like, holy crap! He's a Generation 1! Alright. And if we do get the invitation on March 1, we'll have time to keep training him until we get there. I'm coming, what could it be? Yup, this is a special deal, and... Ura, May 3. All right, let me, let me write that down. There we go, I don't wanna miss that tournament. Okay, so we have a couple months. Well, we have one month we can do training, cause we, we can train through- no, we've got two. We can train through March and April. We just can't train through May. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we'll have 999 speed before we even uh, get to it. Alright. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Fuck Fimba. All we care about are those big four. Alright. I'm so proud of you, Rosewater. And we didn't start feeding Rosewater meat until he was about, what, a year old, I think? Maybe? I don't think we were feeding him meat from from the time we got him, were we? No, we were. It was bum wiggles that we did not feed meat to until the end, I think. Maybe. I don't remember. Whatever. Oh, this will tell me what happens if you get more than the number. Yep, it just stops at 999. All right, fair enough. Okay, next one's accuracy. And then I guess life and maybe power. I mean, we could probably get, well, if I get accuracy up and I get power up, that would reduce the chance that... If I get power up high enough, it'll reduce the number of attacks that are going to be incoming because we will knock them out faster. So power should probably be the priority. All right. After accuracy. Accuracy is still more important right now. Always hit, never be hit. All right. Skill it is. I don't think I've ever raised a monster in any of these runs where I got a... Uh, uh, an attribute up to 999. Period. 
It's a good feeling. I've never been here before. <laughs> and Rosewater's a generation one! <laughs> Holy crap! I'm so proud of them. So I probably could have raised... Who was the hair that we raised earlier? I don't even freaking remember, but... We... Whichever hair I raised before probably could have been raised this way and have done about as well. So... But man, we are burning through cash like crazy. We've spent, what, 40 grand? Mm. If we can't close the deal here, I think I'm gonna have to make another moneymaker because I'm going to need a much bigger buffer. So the 100k was not unrealistic, especially like if you have a golden peach um, and extend the life even one more year. Yeah, you, you need the cash. So yeah, all right, so that's what we'll do. If Grosswater cannot close the deal, then our next monster, I'll probably get another generation one and we'll make, um, we'll just make another moneymaker and just try to get that, try to get it back. But even the moneymaker should still eat meat. They just need to enter every tournament they can once we've got them stable and we have to avoid training courses. But otherwise, we can still feed them meat to extend their lifespan and keep their form high. And then we should have it. It should be, it should be doable. All right. One more week, baby, come on. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm starting to get final boss jitters and I shouldn't because we've still got four tournaments to go. So, and that's assuming I even win this next one. You know, who knows? Master's Cup, yep, we'll, we'll do it. We'll do it, Holly, no worries. It's really helpful that the monsters have never gotten stressed, and I think I'm glad I went for the the monster stable before I bothered with, uh, with... Oh, I haven't saved in a while, shit. No, not that one. <laughs> um, I'm glad I didn't start this strategy until I had that monster hut, because... Removing stress from the equation has definitely helped us. All right, here we go. <sighs> 10 grand is on the line, but I don't even care. I care about the W. Uh, oh, I'm nervous. Look at that packed crowd of highly detailed spectators. Uh, ready, Pyro Falcon? No, I'm sweating. We will be become the number one ranked breeder if we win this. Give it your best. I will, Holly. Let's go. Holly, I'm going to give you the biggest hug if we get through this. This is already not off to a great start, because if we're fighting a defense-heavy monster, we're going to be in trouble, since I'm not going to be able to land enough blows to counter even one attack. At this point, it's playing the percentages, so... And the RNG. It's RNG and percentages, man. That's That's... What it comes down to. Life percentages. Oh, his life isn't all that high. He's got respectable accuracy and dodge rate and defense, though, so... Here we go. I still have high to hits on those furthest attacks. I need to stay away from them as much as I can. At least until I get my guts charged up. We'll fight him like we did the previous... Like Guardian. Yeah, the, the other model. All right, that's immediately not good. All right, get him. See, th this is what I was concerned about, that his he's got enough life that now that he's landed even just a single attack, we don't have the power. Yeah, and he's put me in a position where I have to use the one too. We don't have the power to do enough damage to wear him down to to get that percentage that we need. Just go full aggression. It doesn't matter. Drain your guts. Uh, I think we're ahead. I think we got him because he's got the flashing bar. 
Yes! Oh, barely. All right, good job, buddy. Good job, Rosewater. Two more like that. Ugh, that dodge rate. That's the only thing keeping us up. All right. Shing the Golem. Ugh. Is that what? That, what is he crossed with? That looks. It, it looks like it should be a tiger pattern, but it's a very light blue. Wow, he's got good accuracy. No dodge. Less defense than, um, than the monol. Nothing but one percent chance to hit. That's good. Okay, so. Every time he does a chop, my breath catches in my throat a little bit. Like, playing the odds, he's not going to hit us, but, you know. I have no fucking words. That was a 1% chance to hit. I'm not concerned about his fame, Holly. His, his fame is the last thing on my mind right now. God damn it. Fuck this game, in a way. I love it, but holy shit, man. Oh, and June 1 was supposed to be an invita- It was supposed to be an invitation. Oh, I still got the invitation anyway. That's weird. Okay, August 3. Hold on, let me write that down too. Well, we may have lost, but at least that tournament gave me a little insight. Our accuracy is not awful. It's our power that needs help more than anything. Um... Yeah, it's it's our power that needs help because we weren't able to we weren't able to do any damage beyond chip damage. And that's not gonna get us through some of these tournaments. I can't believe he landed a one percent. I've seen your comments. I, I I've got um a few people who are insisting that the percentages are lying. That the game is not giving you fair numbers. Um I mean, I know it feels like it, but, I mean, a 1% chance is still a 1% chance. It's not a 0% chance. So it's like... I don't know. I, I don't know. It may have been fair, and it we may have just drawn a very short straw. Uh, I'm just glad he didn't die. That would have shattered my heart if that was a kill shot. I'm gonna have to just cram Taffy in his mouth before any S-Class tournament for that reason. I, I cannot risk him going down. Alright. I didn't come this far just to lose my monster right at the end. Okay, uh, so, do some training, and we need to work on our power, not speed, power. Yeah, now it's all about the numbers, not the techniques. I'm just glad I did get his defense up another level, because, I mean, if he had had less than 100 defense when he took that shot... I don't even want to know what kind of numbers that would have hit him with. Ugh. Poor Rosewater. He's really taken some abuse in his career. Alright, that's a new power level. That helps. We'll just keep him doing power courses for a while. Ooh, that was a big, sh big loss. A big loss of progression. Maybe just because he was tired. Uh, that was worrisome, but okay, whatever. 
Okay. Nom nom. So that's gonna do it for this episode. Um, let me check his number. Oh wow, he didn't gain another power level. We'll get him there though. We'll uh, put him on a power uh, power work. Um, how many times has he been injured? Only three. God, it's felt so much worse than that. All right. Well, that's gonna do it for today. Um, we'll try the mo the monsters cup in the next one. Thank you all very much for watching, and I will see you again tomorrow for another episode.